Yo, what's good, y'all, man? We got what uh, for kind of have a trailer official update, man. It's 80 with likes on my channel, and um, yeah, let's get it. What's going on guys? Welcome to Everything Always. My name's Michael Roman, aka Allfires. We actually got some news today about the Wakanda Forever upcoming first trailer. We're obviously within the normal six month window and with Thor Love and Thunder right on the horizon, there was a report from an industry insider editorial indicating it was coming sooner than later, actually had an exact time and place. Well, believe it or not, and in a very rare turn of events, something that never usually happens, Disney's marketing president actually weighed in. We're going to break down what the report mm. was. Okay. They had information from a credible source, and they have had things right in the past, but then we'll talk about what actually happened from Disney's marketing president and what he said about that report. We're breaking down everything, the brand new trailer for Wakanda Forever, and why this is kind of curious, but first, if you could grab the subscribe button, we do daily Marvel content at the channel, that's all we do. Everything from official Easter egg breakdowns, trailers, and reviews, to the occasional industry insider report and everything in between. So, if that sort of thing's for you, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment down below that will automatically enter you to win our ongoing PS5 giveaway if you want. Stick around at the end the video we'll get into all the giveaway stuff again there so this was originally reported by the one ring.net then followed up by re-reporting in several places mm -hmm. that the black panther wakanda forever trailer would be released during game four of the nba finals oh shit here we go but i mean every trailer always is a, is, a, is always um doing games like doing the super bowl Doing the playoffs, like the finals right now, you know what I'm saying, and um, or just any any big event going on, you know, in IRL. So I kind of expect that shit, you know. What I mean, I could, I mean, I kind of didn't expect. I thought it was gonna be like a regular trailer just coming out, but it's black, it's Black Panther. So you know, what I mean, they gotta show love. You feel me, type shit. <laughs> on Friday night. Well, as this was quickly re-reported on Friday night, oh, this week. Um, social media the digital marketing president from disney asad ayaz quickly responded by saying that this information was simply quote inaccurate didn't offer any mm, yeah i mean thor you could tell like okay yeah they're coming out but black panther i don't know <laughs> any other information than that now it is marvel studios normal mo not to weigh in on rumors but the fact remains that game four of the nba finals on friday night is literally about 48 hours away and that's what i said like it's damn near right there so they were like i say on the third like you know like thor th like love thor thor um thunder they you know put twitter saying oh yeah we're gonna drop um premiere trailer woo -woo type shit you know what i mean but i don't see nothing on twitter for black panther but you you know it's still wednesday thursday tomorrow we see, you know what I mean? It might pop a Twitter like Thor, I love Thor, love Thor Thunder, but I don't know. <laughs> we see though, we see. And perhaps he just saw this and knew it wasn't true. However, not calling it false and or debunking it completely, just saying inaccurate, does sort of leave the door wide open for them to be able to air the trailer. Number one, the one ring.net has had credible stories in the past and doesn't mean that all of their sources are wrong. Also, things are super fluid as far as Disney's marketing goes. We see evidence of this all the time, so perhaps their story was just outdated intel. Also though, if you were gonna run a trailer during the NBA Finals with no guarantee of a game five or six, you would put it in the game four slot to start with. But after some of the wins and losses mean that the games will go further, they might look to push that trailer as far out as possible. Look, Thor Love and Thunder is right around the corner, and the way that Marvel Studios has been doing it recently, with as many projects as they have, there's a good reason not to release a Wakanda Forever trailer right now. Miss Marvel literally just launched, and they want as much attention on that, and then on Thor Love and Thunder as possible. No need for an extra trailer right now. However, we do know that the film is finished, and of course, with no major film from Marvel Studios, between Thor Love and Thunder, and then the very late release this year, Wakanda Forever, it's safe to say a trailer is coming soon, just not in Game 4 of the NBA Finals, perhaps Game 5 or 6, or maybe a little further out than that, when Thor finally hits theaters the beginning of next month. Guys, let me know all your thoughts down below, how hyped you are for Wakanda Forever, and what you- I'm very hyped. 
I'm very hyped for um, Black Panther, no cap. Anticipate they're gonna show in that first trailer. I sure hope they just go ahead and show us Namor, blow the lid off this thing and let the theories fly instead of us having to wonder whether or not he's still in it with all these pseudo confirmations. Let me know all your thoughts down below quickly. Let's jump into the giveaway stuff. Hey, now I'm very hyped, but I don't think they'll come game for. Well, hey, anything possible, little well, man. So, hey, we see that. Hey, we see. Anyway, leave a like on my channel. That was official trailer. Update, man. Say so, hey, leave a like, sub, and um, yeah. Peace.